Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. So I've been to my local car boot sale recently and I've also been to some charity shops and in this video I'd like to show you some of the bargains that I've picked up, fishing tackle bargains used and new and I just want to show you what is out there and what you can get for very little money to get into fishing or if you're on a tight budget. Okay so this is all the stuff that I bought this week from my local car boot sale let me show you what i got so start off with this bait box it says on it off box i believe that's preston a really nice quality bait box nice stiff lid and it's in really good condition as you can see so it's made to fit in with um, a preston seat box and all that arrangement. Really stiff lid, that bait's never coming out of that once the lid's on. Almost almost brand new. 50, oh no, not 50p, I paid 20 pence for that. I don't think the man knew what it was, he thought it was just a Tupperware. 20p, what a bargain. So that, I bought this from um, uh, a guy who sells tackle, so this was new. Um, it's a Signet heavy duty baiting needle. So I paid £2.75 for this because I fancied a new needle. Um, so not a, not a super bargain, but I just needed one. Next up, we've got these two reel cases. So they're both new. This is just on a normal stall with random stuff on it. Two NGT reel cases. I already use these cases. Um, so I've already got some of these, but I fancied a few more and this guy was selling them. So I paid two pounds each for these, two pounds each. I think that's a real bargain. I like these cases because they've got padding they're generous size, pretty good. Two quid each, super deal. And they're brand new as well. So I've got those. I also bought this pack of Grumpy, Grumpy Baby they're called. Um, fishing lures, 13 gram, 11 centimeter. Three piece pack of lures. Um, it's got a picture of a pike on the back and a zander. So, bought these lures, £1.50 for the pack. I think that's okay. Next up, there's this. So, a little fishing tackle set. I paid a pound for this. I don't need this, but for a pound, I thought I'd get it. It has some line on it, uh, a little spool of six and a half kilo line, 25 meters there. There's some hooks, swivels, shot. There's a float there, and then there's a little float with a with a, a full rig on it, all for a pound. So again, quite a good deal, I think. What else did I get? I bought these NGT Waggler floats, a five pack of floats. Again, I bought these from um, a guy who sells fishing stuff. These are £2.25, so can't argue with that. Really cheap. Um, they're pre-loaded as well with weights at the bottom. So you haven't got to put too much shot on them. So that's that. And then I got these two items from one store. I got these for £3 for the two items. So there's a, a bulk spool of Daiwa Sensor £6 line. It's probably about half the spool left. Um, it says 2,320 meters. So yeah, there's there's loads of line left on this. And I've used Daiwa Sensor line before and I really like Daiwa Sensor line. It's pretty good, pretty strong line. So I've got that and then I've got this um, telescopic little rod with a nice yellow tip on it. So three pounds for the rod and the line. It's a bit beaten up this rod. It needs a bit of a clean up. Needs a couple of the eyes probably gluing back in position as well, just to make it all good. But a 
fishing rod and some line for three quid. I think that's a bargain. So what else I got um, on the weekend was this kit here. And I bought this from the Salvation Army uh, charity shop for £4. So I paid £4 for this. And it's a full set. It's called Aquarius Starter Course Set. So let's just take a look. This has never been used. Again, I don't need this, but for £4 I thought it's too much of a bargain to ignore. So it's a full fishing set for kids or beginners and to be honest it's not bad quality either it's quite good so it's got the carry case I'll show you all the items in here where's the zip so this might be ideal if you're going on holiday but yeah the idea of this video is just to show you what what bargains I've picked up what bargains are out there, what things you can get, prices you might pay if you buy used gear. If you don't want to spend too much on fishing equipment, look at the car boot sales, look in charity shops, that sort of thing. So, there's quite a few items in here. Um, so you've got the carry case here, there's a tackle box. Look at that. Tackle box with all bits and bobs in it. Disgorge, uh, swivels, hooks, um, shots. There's even some lures in here. There's some like little, little crayfish lures. Little tackle box. There's a miniature little bait box. Reminds me of one I had when I was a kid. Good quality little bait box. You get some floats. There's five floats in a pack. Uh, there's a little booklet here. It says, um, in conjunction with Angling Times Aquarius, an introduction to angling. So if you've ever had one of these sets, please let me know in the, the comments. I'm wondering how old it is. So there's a little book here that's got yeah loads of interesting information about fishing, how to set up rigs, that sort of thing. And then you've got the rod itself. I'm quite impressed with the reel. The reel isn't too bad at all. So, I don't know what make of reel it is because everything is branded with this Aquarius logo, but it's only a basic reel, but it's very smooth and it's not too bad at all. I think it's about a 1000 size, really smooth little reel, telescopic rod, yeah, yeah not a bad looking rod, doesn't tell you the casting weight or the, the length of the rod or does it um, no it doesn't appear to but nonetheless a nice little nice little starter rod again very impressed with that just checking if there was anything in there but there isn't four pounds for a rod a reel there's line on the, the reel there's floats everything you need to set up a rig a bait box and a little carry case all for four pounds. So I also bought one other thing. I was in um, my local Poundland and I found these scales. They're called luggage scales for travel. And I thought these would be ideal for weighing fish as well electronic scales put a few batteries in here just wanted to mention this because i paid three pounds for this and i've seen almost the identical scale online on sites um sold marketed as a fishing scale but for more money so you would pay more depending on the marketing but whether it's a travel scale or a fishing scale it's going to do the same job and there you go so a digital scale for three quid for fishing just goes to show if you look around you can get fishing tackle especially if you're starting out getting into fishing don't have to spend a lot of money on stuff I've got plenty of stuff here that I could just 
use for going fishing. I've got pretty much a full setup here for almost no money at all. So there you go, you can buy cheap gear if you look for it. Okay, so that is about it for this video. I hope you liked the video, and if you did, please remember to like and also consider subscribing for more fishing-related videos. And as always, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.